Sashastra Sima Bal SSB, in English the Armed Border Force rarely translated into English in Indian usage, is one of India's central armed police forces. It is currently under the administrative control of the Ministry of Home Affairs MHA, Government of India. Prior to 2001, the force was known as the Special Service Bureau SSB. As of 2017, it has 76,337 active personnel in 67 battalions. History The Special Service Bureau also abbreviated SSB was set up in early 20 December 1963, following the Sino-Indian War. The primary task of the force was to provide armed support for the Research and Analysis Wing India. S Foreign Intelligence Agency, with a secondary objective to inculcate feelings of national belonging in the border population and assist them in developing their capabilities for resistance through a continuous process of motivation, training, development, welfare programs and activities in the then NIFA, North Assam the northern areas of the Indian state of Assam, North Bengal the northern areas of the Indian state of West Bengal and the hills of Uttar Pradesh, Himachal Pradesh and Ladakh. The program was later extended to Manipur, Tripura, Jammu in 1965, Meghalaya in 1975, Sikkim in 1976, the border areas of Rajasthan and Gujarat in 1989, Manipur, Mizoram and further areas of Rajasthan as well as Gujarat in 1988, South Bengal the southern areas of West Bengal, Nagaland in 1989, and the Nubra Valley, Rajouri and the Poonch district of Jammu. Jammu and Kashmir in 1991, its primary purpose was to counter an act of aggression by the people's Liberation Army. The previous thinking had been that, militarily, the Chinese were superior to India and in the event of a war, the Chinese might attempt to overwhelm Indian forces. So, in 1963, a unique force was created, which would, in the event of such an attempt by the Chinese to invade and occupy Indian territory, merge with the border population, donning civilian attire, working a parallel administration and carry out the War of India with the help of guerrilla tactics. The SSB model proved an enormous success, evident by what it had achieved in training the Mukti Bahini in Bangladesh and other places, coin ops in the northeast and in its ability to provide security at high peaks during the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971 as well as during the Kargil War. From the cabinet, the SSB was transferred to the Ministry of Home Affairs and assigned the duties of manning the Nepal and Bhutan borders. The SSB was renamed the Sashastra Sima Bal, in accordance with its new role, and would come under the administrative control of the Ministry of Home Affairs in January 2001. This was done after the Kargil War with the adoption of the One Border One Force concept. In the 40 years of its existence, SSB endeavoured to present a benign face of the government among border populace in the far-flung and inaccessible areas subscribing to the ethos of service, security and brotherhood. The local populace always found SSB standing steadfastly with them during difficult times, pursuant to the recommendations of a group of ministers on reforming the national security system. SSB was declared as a border guarding force and led intelligence agency for Indo Nepal border June, 2001, and assigned the task of guarding the 1,751 km long Indo Nepal border along the states of Uttarakhand, 263.7 km with three districts, Uttar Pradesh. 199.3 kilometers with 7 districts Bihar 800.4 kilometers with 7 districts West Bengal 105.6 kilometers with 1 district and Sikkim 99 kilometers in March 2004, SSB was assigned the task of guarding the 699 km stretch of Indo-Bhutan border along the states of Sikkim 32 kilometers West Bengal 183 kilometers with two districts, Assam 267 km, with four districts and, Arunachal Pradesh 217 km, with two districts. Since then SSB was rechristened into Sashastra Sima Bal and reached new heights. SSB is the first border guarding force that has decided to recruit women battalions. It is doing excellent job as border guarding force on Indo-Nepal and Indo-Bhutan border. SSB is also engaged in counterinsurgency operations in Jammu and Kashmir and anti-Naxal operations in Jharkhand, Bihar and Chhattisgarh. 
It is also performing internal security duties i.e. election duties and law and order duties in different parts of India. SSB celebrated the year 2013 as Golden Jubilee Year marking 50 years of its raising. The celebrations have commenced with the flag off of a Mount Everest expedition on 2 April 2013 from Delhi. The team led by Commandant Somit Joshi successfully reached at the peak at about 9.45 a.m. east on 21 May 2013 to commemorate the 50th anniversary. In 2014, the Government of India approved the recruitment of women as combat officers in SSB. Topic. Role Topic. The previous role of the Special Service Bureau was to motivate and mobilize India's border population for national security during times of peace as well as war and to promote a sense of security and brotherhood among the population, in furtherance of national integration. Its present-day role consists of preventing cross-border crime and smuggling as well as other anti-national activities. In pursuit of achieving this mandated task, the SSB has been conferred with certain powers under the Criminal Procedure Code of 1973, the Arms Act of 1959, the NDPS Act of 1985 and the Passport Act of 1967. The Government of India also contemplates conferring additional powers under the Customs Act of 1962. These powers are to be exercised within a belt of 15 kilometers in the states of Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, West Bengal, Sikkim, Assam and Arunachal Pradesh, running along the Indo-Nepal and Indo-Bhutan borders, as well as in any other area of SSB operation. Organization <inaudible> 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 Prior to 2001, the force was known as the Special Service Bureau SSB. As per its revised role, the Uniform Wing worked under the operational command of civilian officers. It was in 1985 that a 15% quota of area organizers, for promotion to the rank of Deputy Inspector General, was given to the Commandants of the Uniform Wing. The civil wing worked in the area of operations AOPs along the Indo-Tibet and Indo-Pakistan border. Recruitment in uniform wing would be from among Indian youth of the border area who have undergone advanced training in guerrilla warfare and also selected by the respective operational commander such as by the divisional organizer, area organizer, sub-area organizer and circle organizer. The divisional organizer was equivalent in rank to that of Inspector General of Police, specifically earmarked for the respective AOPs to which they belonged and were activated by. The repercussions of the closure of the old role have been debated and deliberated in the defense establishments and now the relevance of the old role of SSB has been realized for the security of the border area, as such a role is likely to be revived. The highest level headquarters of the force is Force Headquarters FHQ, also called the Directorate General of SSB, located in the Indian capital of New Delhi. Force Headquarters FHQ is commanded by an officer of the rank of Director General. The Director General is assisted by the additional Director General. Various directorates including Operations and Intelligence, Personnel and Training, Administration, Provisioning and Communication, Medical, as well as others, function under the DG. Each directorate is headed by an IG and assisted by a DIG and other officers. Frontier Headquarters FTRHQ is commanded by an officer of the rank of Inspector General IG, who is placed next in the chain of command after the FHQ. FTRHQR, in turn, exercises command and control over the sector HQs. The SSB Battalion, is commanded by an officer of the rank of Commandant and who is assisted by officers of the rank of Second in Command, Deputy Commandant and Assistant Commandant. The battalion is further divided into Companies and Border Outpost BOP. There are seven companies in a battalion, each company consisting of three Border Outposts. The company is commanded by an assistant commandant and the BOP is commanded by sub-inspectors. Ranks Topic. Present rank structure is as follows Topic. Combatist wing Topic. Topic. Recruitment Topic. Assistant Commandants 
Assistant commandants are appointed as officers are appointed and personnel below officer are recruited in any government organization through a competitive examination conducted by Union Public Service Commission UPSC sub inspectors in GD TEL are appointed as SOs through a competitive examination conducted by SSC and other special vacancies Recruitment of constables and head constables in different branch are also come every year generally Topic. Training centers Topic. Both civil and uniformed cadres of SSB are equally trained in various warfares and other specialized courses such as guerrilla warfare, counter-insurgency, intelligence, demolition, jungle and snow survival etc. There are various training centers within the force and in the training centers of other organizations, agencies. The Gazetid officers are trained at Bhopal SSB Academy. Topic. See also. Topic. Ministry of Home Affairs. Central Reserve Police Force. Indo-Tibetan Border Police. Central Industrial Security Force. Border Security Force. Assam Rifles. National Security Guard Border Outpost Topic References Topic